fail of the day. I'm opening this palette so that I can look at myself in the mirror. Wait. This is the one with the mirror. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to a review on a new weird makeup applicator tool sponge. <laughs> I recently watched Nikki Tutorial's video on this product and as soon as she started like patting it on her skin, I was sold. And I clicked the link and went to buy it right away. So this came actually very quickly, not even a week, I would say not even maybe like three days. So super quick shipping, which I like. And the product I'm talking about, obviously I should probably mention it, is the Juno & Co Microfiber Velvet Sponge. And this is the packaging. This is a sponge. Obviously I used mine today for this video. And yeah, it's a very interesting product. Very, very interesting. It's literally a velvet blender, beauty blender, velvet sponge. And it feels so, so soft when it's dry. And when it's wet, it feels even softer, which is so, so crazy. I don't know, I'm amazed at this sponge, how it worked. My skin foundation, everything hasn't looked so flawless in like ever. <laughs> and this is only $6, $6. And they have free shipping on your first order in the US. I also ordered this silly sponge with a velvet side as well. And this one was only $3. You guys all remember the silly sponge. I did use it, review it, bought, I bought it. I do, will have a link to the video for that sponge in the link in the, I can't talk. I will have the link to the, in the description to the video of the silly sponge. I personally wanted to try this side of this sponge as well, just because I kind of thought that it would be a different application. This one, I would say the fuzzy part is more fuzzy and you can move it back and forth this is straight velvet and this you can definitely feel like I don't know it feels like a baby's blanket it's super super soft like super extremely soft but you can definitely move the little fur fuzzy hairs whatever <laughs> now this one I love the shape of it I actually really really enjoy the shape of it and I don't know what else to say. It's six dollars, super affordable. Um, this website, Juno and Co, reminds me kind of like a uh, Hush, where they have a lot of like dupes for palettes. They have a lot of affordable makeup and tools. So yeah, I will link them down below. And just let's get on to the demo because that's where you get all the info on this. Keep on watching. Now here is the size after I wet it, it definitely is much bigger than what it was, which is what I expected. It feels soft, if not much softer. Yeah, it definitely feels much, much softer. Now, I watched Nikki Tutorial's video, which is why I bought this sponge. And this sponge claims to give you like a natural finish. And I personally really, really enjoy very full coverage. Like I like that cake on this face girl like I like the cake so I was like I'm not really about that life but then I saw her video and when she was applying it and it was looking like full coverage goodness like melting into her skin super flawless and everything and I was like I need that sponge I need it in my life I clicked out of her video went to the link and purchased it <laughs> so Let's try it out and see how it works because I'm super excited. And I will be using a full coverage foundation just to see what uh, natural coverage it can give me using a full coverage foundation. And the super full coverage foundation that I have in my collection is the Huda Beauty foundation. So this is the one I'm going to be using. I do have mine in the color Cheesecake. So let's try it out because I'm excited.
Now I'm a little shooketh right now because this sponge literally filled in my pores like completely to the full fullest extent of the word filled them up like I I can't even believe it though like it gave my skin a flawless flawless look that I've told you guys before that I've had with certain foundations but this is like next level full coverage flawless look like it filled in my fine lines from around my lips it filled in my huge huge pores the crazy thing is I will say it feels dry when you are patting it which is so weird it feels like when I opened it and took it out of the packaging, that's how it feels when I'm patting it on my skin. Now, just because I'm holding it, I know it's wet, but now if someone was applying my foundation on my face with this sponge, I would think they were using a dry sponge if I wasn't holding it because it feels dry. It's so crazy. I've never felt anything like that. Also, I noticed that it doesn't absorb as much product as my Beauty Blenders and Real Techniques sponges, which is so good because that means that all the product that you pump out of your foundation or whatever it is that you're using is going to stay on your face and it's not going to be absorbed so much by the sponge, which in turn saves you product and gives you a more full coverage look. If you don't like that look, just use less product, I would say, but yeah, let's go on to concealer because I'm a little shook. The concealer I'm going to be using today is the Too Faced Born This Way concealer and I have mine in the shade Vanilla so let's go right in. extra extra shook um <laughs> I don't even know what to say like the concealer is all right here and this concealer a little goes a long way so I only have to like take this out and use it for both under eyes I don't dip it in again and apply more product because it is like it says super coverage and this sponge makes it even more super coverage because normally with my other sponges it does not look like this like whatsoever also and i definitely definitely am still on the same page of it feeling dry i was like okay this is not gonna blend because the sponge feels really really dry but it blended out beautifully like i'm like i said again for the 20th time i'm extra shook now, I'm going to be setting my makeup with my KKW Beauty Powder, which is what I always use, and I will be using the velvet sponge on this side, and then the little blanket, the little baby blanket, I'm going to be using it on this side, just to see what the difference is, and yeah, I'm actually excited and a little nervous, so let's get right into it. That's how it looks. I feel like my makeup looks so freaking bomb. I know I look like a cake face right now, but just let me finish. Let me do the whole magic and I think everything will look perfectly fine. If you couldn't already tell by the demo part of the video, 
I freaking love this sponge. Like, I'm obsessed with it. It is going to replace my Beauty Blender, my Real Technique sponge, my Sony Kachuk sponge. Any sponge I own, it's going to replace. Like, the application, the flawlessness that it gave my skin, it's bananas. Like, literally bananas it filled in my fine lines what i love the most is that it filled in my pores like completely and i've never had any foundation any sponge any brush do that until now so yeah i freaking recommend this 100 percent. it's only six dollars it's not gonna break the bank if you don't like it but i'm pretty sure you're going to like it because it's pretty bomb and I will leave the link to their website down below so as of right now I'm obsessed with this I'm going to keep using it I'm going to use it with different foundations and I will definitely update you guys at the end of the month in my monthly favorites video on this sponge because this definitely deserves an update and I will definitely update you guys then but for now I will say that it's freaking bomb and I love it I like, I'm shook at how good it made my skin look. Honestly, I am really, really impressed. So definitely check out the link below. Also, I will leave another link so that you guys can check out this makeup tutorial that I have going on. Super, super dramatic, fiery, um, extra, you know, like I love to be. So yeah, check that tutorial. It's the one before this video, obviously. And with that being said, thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you have any questions on these products, don't forget to leave them in the comment section down below. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video, you know, and follow your girl on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat. You don't have to follow me on all of them. You can choose one of them, but if you don't mind, follow me on all of them. Okay. Okay. Make a bunny Stella. All of them. I hope you guys enjoyed this video trying out these new weird makeup applicators let me know if you guys would like to, me to try out weird makeup that's like popular because it's weird different or like viral makeup that you know is kind of weird <laughs> and yeah with that being said I will see you all in my next video bye